Next, let's set the provider's availability. Recall that Pranav wants to book an appointment with Dr. Daniela Dentist. Before he can do that, we need to configure Dr. Daniela's availability to ensure that Pranav and other patients can only book Dr. Daniela for appointments when she wants them. You can create an availability with a POST request to the availability's endpoint. There's a body object to attach this time, where we can specify that this availability is from Monday through Friday, from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. for Dr. Daniela Dentist. We've also specified the appointment type ID for that new patient cleaning appointment type we created in the prior step. You may also need to specify an operatory, which is the treatment room where the appointment takes place. To find the right operatory ID for Dr. Daniela Dentist, you can retrieve it with a GET request to the operatory's endpoint. When we submit this request, we'll see that Dr. Daniela Dentist has an operatory ID of six. So we can add that to our request and create this availability. Now that we've retrieved the right availability for Dr. Daniela and created it, we can see that this is now visible in the Next Health web app. Before, we had no availability set for Dr. Daniela Dentist. But after we refresh, we'll see that Dr. Daniela Dentist does now have that availability for Monday through Friday, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. for the new patient cleaning appointment type that we just created. It's important to note that availabilities in Next Health can be separate from the schedules available in each health record system. And this is a choice to allow providers to configure a separate schedule for online booking versus other channels. So in this case, we've just configured the provider's availability for online booking, which we now see in the Next Health web app.